Hey you, how you guys doing YouTubers? Uh, welcome to my new channel, make a custom channel. Um, sorry about my eyes are squinting because the sun is kind of bright in here. Right down here in Florida, sunny Florida. Um, just letting you know that my custom channel is going to be based on um, working on a vehicle. I just got myself a little project. The little project is going to be a 1995 Chevy S10. Uh, well, Sonoma. Well, it's the same kind of body style. There she is right there. So, uh, got it for $450. And uh, it runs. It came as it is, as you see it with the rims and all that stuff. Um, the previous owner smashed the vehicle, the front end. Put ended up putting in a black fender. The hood's a little bent. Um, other than that, no big deal. Just got myself a 5.3 engine. It's gonna. It's got a four-cylinder 2.2, and um, ready to go. I take it to work. Go back and forth. Now the engine's hurting a little bit, so this is my chance, my moment to. I'm gonna get myself. Uh, an engine I already got one started building it the only thing is I did not record the process on it so further ado this is my first time doing a YouTube video forgive me guys um, I'm new to this so whatever I do wrong hey don't blame me it's my first one first video so here we go I'm just gonna also show you uh, got to got to clean the heads got the 5.3 rebuild it got uh, the main bearings hey thank you bird uh, got the main bearings installed, piston rings, cleaned out the pistons. I'm gonna keep the same camshaft and uh, new seals, knock sensors, and all that stuff. Uh, the only thing I was not able to do is basically the heads. There you see in the background, and there she is. I was able to put in a new piston because that one, when I ended up getting it from the junkyard, the guy ended up turning the engine and we didn't know there was water in it so that piston was full of water and as he spun the engine through the flywheel he compressed the ring lens on that piston so what I ended up doing is basically found out why and then when I got water out of there oh okay you compressed my ring lens so I'm done I'm done so well there she is cleaned up new piston new piston rings um, Connecting rods, brand new main, brand, brand new connecting rods, brand new main bearings, new piston rings, one new piston. Uh, I'm gonna keep the same crankshaft. I saw nothing wrong with it. Yeah, I'm gonna keep the same camshaft. Saw nothing wrong with it. Uh, whatever it was, they must have had water issues because there was water, like a head blown head gasket or something. But further ado, I did, I did find out one thing. Found out that the head. Is I ended up putting sharpie marks as you can see well, I'm going to show you right now these sharpie marks are where there's cracks or what we call indications but um for example this particular head right here has two all right there was one there you see where the arrow is pointing down and then the other one all right so you'll see better with this one here see you got the little arrows there marked right there the indication and then this particular head has all four they're small they're tiny that's why I ended up putting a uh, sharpie marks on them so that you can just see what I was talking about but I'm gonna lose compression I'm gonna it's gonna leak it's gonna leak through from one valve to another even though they might be closed but it'll leak and I don't like that I don't want that um, I'm gonna go with uh, rebuilt heads because some of these cracks I can see past and it's actually right where the valve seat is. So I'm going to lose air or compression. Um, some people say it's no big deal, run it. But I don't know if there's water jackets going through there. You know, where the water ports and then if there's water in there to cool part of the head down. So I'm just going to not do it basically. Let it be. Uh, again, I'm new to this channel. Forgive me, I got had to practice a lot just to get used to me being me and record myself in videos let's see how far this thing can go um, see if you guys like my channel uh, I'm not gonna say much because I'm new to it but the moment I get heads and start working on it I'm one of those that can just gonna show you videos do do the work and uh, just record me working I'll, so I'll tell you the previews on I me mean, what's going on what's what I'm gonna do blah, 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 blah. just get it done so you'll see me getting it done, but more than likely fast forwarding it because uh, some people get bored just watching videos. So uh, other than that, uh, my first video, we'll see how far this will take me. Um, my brother's been doing it for a long time. 
doing it for three plus years and uh, being successful at it. So, hey, I'm going to give it a shot. It's not going to hurt. I could hurt one bit, but uh, this is where I work out of, a little shed. I used to be under the sun with an umbrella, and then again, the weather, it'll rain, it'll get, it'll get hot, it'll get sunny, it'll get cold, and I'm like, ah, I'm under the elements, so I'm not going to help me. So, let's just hope this works out for me. Uh, I'll keep you guys posted, and uh, we'll see how this goes. Thank you. And by the way, my name is Carlos, uh, Make a Custom Channel. Thank you.